Uh, good evening. And I guess I do mean that. It's um, almost midnight on Friday night, uh, January 27th, the day after my oldest daughter's birthday. But uh, the other day I was looking through our video uh, collection. We've got quite a few DVDs, and I saw one that I would purchased years ago from Red Skelton. Uh, who, if you don't know, was a comedian a clown, basically, uh, when I was a kid, uh, and a, a profound clown, one of those people who said uh, really neat things with humor. Uh, but I was reading through one of his quotes, and he said, uh, I come alive in front of people. I don't know how many people have been following my videos, but it's true for me, too. I read and I thought, it, it's true. I come alive in front of people. I sit here in front of my computer in our 400-year-old house in Switzerland, and I, what I'm trying to convey to you is what I do is so exceedingly different from anything that you've ever seen or done before, and I really can't do it here. I'm going to continue to do these videos to try to uh, impress upon you just how what I do is different. But with the interaction of people, with, uh, with people in the room uh, that I, I can interact with and look into their foibles and what they consider their faults and sit and know one thing about them. Know that they are absolutely perfect. I know that about you. I know that about me. I know that about life. I, I don't understand that comment. I don't understand even how it even remotely can be possible unless I'm in the experience of it. And when I work, I'm in the experience of it, and I can see that oftentimes people are not. They don't see themselves as perfect. They don't see their lives as perfect. They don't see what they're doing as perfect, and they're taking the whole, excuse me, fucking thing fairly serious, and it's not. And it, the, the whole thing is, is what Red Skelton said, and you would say, apparently... Whenever I saw him, he was in front of people, so he was doing that. He came alive, and he was completely alive in all of his different characters and things. And that's what happens in my classes. We had dinner tonight, and we had some people over, and they showed us what the Alexander technique is, which it is quite a fascinating technique. If you have a chance, go find somebody that does it. But there were people around. And I got to interact, and I got to have fun, and I got to push a little bit and look into their psyches and see where are they. Look into their spear, spirits and see how do we enhance it, how do we have fun with it. And we had a blast. We laughed. We had a great time this evening. But it was because I was in front of people. I'm going to try to do that in my uh, videos from now on. I'm going to try to interact with this as if y'all are here. Uh, I don't know how to do that. But that's when I come alive. That's who I am. That's what I want to share with you because I have an amazing way to alter, not to alter, to allow your systems to default to an operating system that is so much fun for you. I don't know if that made sense. I don't really care. It's late on a Friday evening, and I'm okay with it. www.micpeakperformance.com my editors will edit this out if it's not really that good. Have fun.